Let's head to the voicemail of Truth and Reason for the first time today. Ask Mr. Stepanski, who's now Coach of the Year again and will never win a Super Bowl at all if he continues to do what he's doing as a coach. Those two coaches coach the team. I hope he watched it. They were involved in everything that the team did. It's unfortunate that someone had to lose, but tell him to keep an eye on that because we're going to build a new stadium and we're going to do this. They're never going to win anything with Coach Stepanski as their coach or even Andrew Berry. I hope they watched and I hope maybe he listened about something. Give up the play calling and coach the team. Thanks, guys. I'll talk to you again. Take care. Bye now. All right, uh, that's that's Jim from Rochester. You know what? It's kind of interesting. I was talking earlier today. Andy Reid, for the first ten years in his of his career, was the guy that couldn't win the big game. Now it's Kyle Shanahan that can't win the big game. It, you know, it, everything has to align. And and if you think about the Super Bowl yesterday, Patrick Mahomes didn't look great until the game was on the line. <laughs> No, you're right about that, and it's a great point about Andy Reid, right? I mean, people were criticizing him. Um, I'm sure people – I know people are criticizing Kyle Shanahan, and there's a couple points there. One, like, when you look back at it, the game's over, Patrick Mahomes wins two in a row, three out of five, right? And it feels inevitable after the fact. Oh, it's Patrick Mahomes. You knew he was going to lead that tying field goal drive. You knew he was going to lead that winning touchdown drive in overtime. Well, I mean, that's how it worked out. But there's 10 plays in that game that if they go the other way, the Chiefs don't win. And it's not inevitable. And you can beat Patrick Mahomes, right? So you do need things to come together. Now it helps to have the best quarterback in the league. There's no doubt about it. And he helps create the inevitabilities, right? But on fourth and one, what if it's a bad snap? And there were about 20 bad snaps. It felt like he was reaching down to the ground all day. What if it bounces? He gets stuck. Bosa gets him, right? Game's over. I mean, there's a million things like that where – he makes the right decision. Things go their way, and it happens. So it just tells you how, you know, the margin of error is so small in this league and on that stage. Um, but then, to get to the caller, I mean, I love the passion. But Andy Reid calls the plays. Kyle Shanahan calls the plays. Every time the camera shows Kyle Shanahan, he's looking at his play sheet, even when they're on defense. So I, I just think that's I just think that's a misconception. I think it's an incorrect narrative involving Kevin Stefanski. He's not any different than those guys. When it comes to being involved, uh, they do the same roles. He has the same roles. Um, Sean McVay, they do the same thing. And those guys all get to Super Bowls and win Super Bowls. And it's not because they don't call the plays.